Hello, this is Joe Brown here at Financial Wellness University. And the seventh phase of my system, the seventh phase of financial wellness is enjoy. Enjoy money. Let's have a conversation around how we can enjoy the money that we have. <music> Right. So I believe that one of the basic reasons to have money is to find some enjoyment. People people uh are living longer despite what people say on on the on the flip side they say life is short. So I'm going to enjoy every minute of it. But that's a good mantra for life. But you have to enjoy it responsibly. Is that, isn't that what they say about drinking alcohol? Enjoy it responsibly. I mean, because what, what happens? If you enjoy it too much, you're drunk. If you enjoy it too much, you get into accidents. If you enjoy it too much... You spend your money to where you get hooked. Now you're an alcoholic. So enjoying too much can have negative consequences if we don't control and do the enjoyment in a wise and calculated manner. In my book that will be coming out soon, one of the things I talk about is how do you enjoy your money in, in different ways we enjoy. I mean, for instance, we sleep one third of our lives. Wouldn't it be good to enjoy that sleep? I mean, for the beginning part of my marriage, we slept on a bed that was basically a hand-me-down from when I was uh, single, or not really a hand-me-down, but basically the same mattress that we had as a single, I moved over and used it in the marriage, but we soon upgraded to a different mattress because one, that mattress was small and it was good enough for one person, but for two people, we we saw real quickly that that's not the size that we need. So we upgraded. And then we most recently upgraded to uh, an, another mattress. And we did a lot of research and found, hey, we got to enjoy, you know, we sleep. We don't want to wake up with pains. We don't want to wake up. Uh, you know, or go and sleep on something that's uncomfortable, especially as you as you get older, your sleep matters even more because you know your joints can't can't recover as easy as they did when you were young. So sleep matters. The pillow you sleep on, the mattress you sleep on, the 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 covers that that are on the bed that they be saw what you wear to bed, your pajamas. I mean, all those things play into how you sleep. And all those things play into how you enjoy your life and the money. So budget those things out. Food. No, I don't believe you should eat out every night if, if that's not in your budget. But I'm not against spending a little bit more for higher quality foods, organic, fresh. Because, because we are living longer lives, the more we take care of our bodies, the better quality of life we're going to have. 
So having a whole lot of money but not enjoying it, I don't really understand. I know a lot of wealthy people, rich people, are very frugal. But frugal doesn't mean cheap. Frugal doesn't mean necessarily mean penny pinch. Frugal means wise purchase, getting the best value for your dollar. Frugal could mean instead of paying, overpaying for something, negotiate a better deal for that nice high quality item or search and try to get it on sale or look to other sources to get the same item. Maybe a pre-owned might be a better option. You still get the quality, but you get it at a lower price. So I like to enjoy life. And I talked about some of the ways I enjoy it. Um, collections, you know, hobbies, like um, watches. I enjoy my money by buying nice watches. Watches that are within my budget. And I collect like coins and and things like that. So this this particular watch blends the best of both. It's a coin watch, coin face watch, and it's a and, and it's a watch. So it has the best of both. And it actually was a gift. So I didn't even didn't even have to spend money. I get to enjoy something that was uh, given to me. But the gift was right on time with my particular likes, my uh, enjoyments in life. So, I mean, you can enjoy life and enjoy it within your budget. Have a budget category that says, you know, uh, enjoyment or splurge account or whatever, you know, if it's something that you enjoy, maybe take a class, you know, if you enjoy learning, put an educational line item in your budget so you can learn new things. One of the local high schools has an adult um, um, educational institute where you can learn all kinds of neat little things like dancing or uh, how to better use your computer or graphics. You know, th th things like that. I mean, you can learn or you can maybe go to community college and learn some of those things. But the idea is that, or online, there's there's forums where you can learn all kinds of things. You're on YouTube right now. There's so many ways to learn about how to improve your life by watching instructional videos. So, I'm just here as a coach, as a, a mentor in the process to help you enjoy this. I'm not a financial advisor, I'm not licensed or any of that, but uh, I want to help you enjoy life. And uh, if you like this video, I ask you that you hit that thumbs up so that you can... Um, Make this video more available to more people. Share it. Comment below. And if you haven't done also, subscribe to the channel so that you will get more content about how to have wellness, financial wellness in your life. I thank you for watching and have a blessed life.